When I was a kid, I wanted to get a buzz cut in the worst way. I really wanted to get a buzz cut. That was like the haircut. I went to the local barber, I don't know how old I was, five, six years old. Hey kid, what kind of haircut you want? I said, Jazzy, I want a buzz cut. He looks at me and says, kid, I'm never giving you a buzz cut. And I said, why, Jazzy? He said, because your head's not shaped right. I was crushed. This scarred me for life. Look, I know I got a big head. Don't tell me my head's not shaped right. I was devastated. And from that point onward, I wore a lot of hats. What's good is these days, I get a lot of hats. I get a lot of cool hats. People give me hats in swag bags. I go places that give me hats, like this one, this awesome hat. I went to NHRA a couple of weeks ago. This is from Clay Milliken's team. Cool hat, huh? I like it. A little too tight, but I like it a lot. I'm gonna always stretch with this hat. This hat, signed by Jimmy Johnson. I love this hat. It fits really well, but because Jimmy signed it, I'm probably not gonna wear it that often. I get this hat from Austin Dillon, but I forgot to have him sign it. I get all these hats. Often, they don't fit. Like this Jaguar hat. This is an awesome hat. I love it. It almost fits. Almost fits. It's still just like a little too small. Whatever, it's a cool hat. One day I'm wearing a hat. I make the mistake of wearing a hat to Trader Joe's. I'm in Trader Joe's, you know, just minding my own business, finding all the goodies. And this Trader Joe's employee, he's just looking at me, smiling. I'm like, what? What's up? And he's just smiling. I'm like, dude, what's up? And he just says one word, Jaguar. Hey, all I got is the hat. I wish I owned a Jaguar, but I don't. Love driving them, but I don't own one. So, when you wear somebody's hat, you're wearing their logo. This hat, Clutch Crew, from my good friends at Valvoline. I love wearing this hat. It's a cool logo because people don't know what it is and it fits really well. I like flat brims, all's good there. This YouTube hat, this thing, I like snapbacks a lot, but I'm on the last snap on this and it still doesn't fit right. Danny, you're like driving all over the place. Would you get to the point already? All right, here's the point. I find this company, Lamoud Big Hats. They're the sponsors of this video. They specialize in hats for guys with big heads, like me. Now, yeah, I got a big head, not like I got a giant ego. It's just that my cranium is like too big and I got all this stupid hair. Anyway, I find Lamoud Hats it's like heaven. I find out that they're running a, a promo thing for YouTubers, they wanna get the word out. Cool. They said, measure your head. All right, so I get a tape measure, and I'm like, you know, wrap it around, I measure my head. I think I got it right. You know, it's like somewhere around 25 inches, something like that, and I, I thought, you know, that's like around a seven and five base. So I said, you know what? Flat bill, fitted. This is a sweet hat. They send it out. I dig it, man. I like the way it looks. But it feels a little tight because maybe my hair grew just a little bit from the time when I put the tape measure on until I got the hat. I said to him, I love this hat, but it's a little bit too tight. They said, you want to try another hat? He said, yeah, you know, I like snapbacks and I like trucker hats. 
Let me see what else you got. And I found this one. Kind of a distressed looking hat. But look at the size of the noggin hole. It's huge. This is huge. And it's got Velcro back here for adjustability. They sent this out. Bam, perfect. This is the best fitting hat I've ever worn in my entire life. Now, it looks a little, I don't know what, goober? What's the right word? You know, it's got the distressed look. It's not a flat brim, but it fits really, really well. This has become my favorite hat for wearing when I just don't care what I look like. <laughs> you know, this is like the go-to driving hat now, but when people aren't gonna critique my appearance. Dig this hat a lot. Lamoud Big Hats. You got a big head, you wanna check out Lamoud Big Hats. They got a cool selection. This is just two examples. If you order from them, use the mpg matic code. I think you get 10% off, which is pretty cool. Let me show you some of the other cool stuff I got. Mopar hat. Huh? I like this one and it almost fits. When I put this one on, it's like, I want to go to the drag strip. Ford hat, doesn't really fit. Chevy hat, I wear it when I'm driving a Chevy, but it's kind of tight. This Chrysler hat, man, this is one of my favorite hats. This, I love this hat so much that I wish I had a Chrysler. Huh? Not bad. Demon hat. One of the coolest hats I own. It fits, it's stretchy, but I can't wear this any place where someone's gonna criticize it for whatever reason. Look at this, a Scion hat. Now I don't wear this one. If you own a Scion and you got a great story, tell me about it down in the comments and I'll send you this hat. This Highlander hat, cool hat but totally not me. This, this reminds me of like a mom who's a runner and drives a Highlander. If you're a hot mom and you're a runner and you drive a Highlander, tell me your story, I'll send you this hat. This one, Forerunner hat, this is a cool hat. I like Forerunners, but this hat doesn't fit me. If you got a Forerunner, tell me a story and I'll send you this hat. I'm gonna wait until there's some really good stories though, so don't give me a dumb story. I want a really good story. And this one, this Corolla hat, I was gonna send this out to Pedro. But Pedro, come on, man. You like got rid of your Corolla and you bought, I think you bought a Yaris, right? Now I can't send you the Corolla hat. Oh, here's another hat that I really dig. The eBay Motors hat that uh, I picked up while on the on the road Rutledge Wood 67 Mustang Fastback Tour, which I'm covering for eBay Motors. I'll put a link down in the description, you can check that out. Dig this one a lot. Oh man, I got one more hat. Let me show you this one. This one's really cool. One more from Valvoline. This one is signed by Jimmy Johnson, Dale Earnhardt Jr., Clay Milliken, and the latest one, Tanner Gray, youngest ever NHRA Pro Stock winner. I dig this one a lot, but I don't know how much more I'm gonna wear it because, you know, it's all signed and stuff. I have one more cool signed hat in here someplace. Oh yeah. This original old school MPG Omatic hat signed by Gary W. Talent, the bass player in the E Street Band. Another one that goes on a shelf. Getting back to it, if you got a big head, you need a hat that's made for your big head. You wanna to go to Lamoud Big Hats, use the MPG Omatic code, get your 10% off, and get a hat that actually fits your head. Could be flap brim, could be this gooberesque, distressed trucker hat. They got a whole bunch, they got bucket hats. Go check it out. Thanks as always for watching. And the next video I promise will be back to normal automotive content, even though this really is about driving. 
We'll catch you down the road.